Hey guys, welcome back to Nani Pine Life here. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you're doing well out there. So as promised, I wanted to show you on this 2010 Grand Caravan SXT with the 3.8 liter V6 um, how to remove the thermostat. Now I've already removed the thermostat, but, but I did not put the new one in, so I wanted to show you that. It's a real easy process. So right here I've got the old thermostat. Here I've got the new one. So your thermostat is located in your upper radiator hose, which is connected to your engine block right here. So you're going to, in order to get access to these two screws here, there's one up here and there's one down here. I found it's easiest if you just disconnect these boots, they're numbered. So you don't have to worry about not knowing where they go after you do this. These are for cylinders two, four, and six on the front. So as I said, there's two bolts here. They're 10 millimeter bolts. I've already loosened them up. What I can tell you is you'll need a wrench to take the bolts off because of the shape of the uh, upper radiator hose. A ratcheting wrench isn't going to work and a socket wrench isn't going to work just due to the shape so you'll need a wrench and a wrench only. 10 millimeter is the only thing that's going to work. So we'll go ahead and set those bolts aside. As you can see that's where your thermostat goes and it connects to the engine block right there. So we'll go ahead, get our new thermostat out. The uh, thermostat, the operating temp is 195. So make sure you, your thermostat um, opens at 195. Here's what our new thermostat looks like. Now if you'll notice on this um, upper radiator hose, there's a little indicator here that tells you where this goes. You can't just stick it in there. You can see it's kind of offset. So align this indicator here with that little pin in the thermostat. Take your fingers, press down, make sure you get it in there and seated correctly all the way. There you go. We've got that seated in there correctly now. Now it's just a matter of doing what you just did in the opposite order. Just tighten your screws up again, starting by hand, of course. Not the, the top one is tight enough. Now I'm going to do the bottom one. You probably can't see it from the camera angle, but. I like to get these as tight with my hand as I can because it's a lot quicker. Then using the wrench. Okay, so that's what that should look like right there. 
Now obviously you have to tighten it with a wrench. If you didn't catch my last video, the reason why I'm changing this thermostat is because the temperatures have been getting colder up here and when we want to use the heat inside the van, it would only blow uh, cold air. It wasn't AC cold, but it wasn't warm. And in my previous video, I showed you how to test the thermostat to see whether it was functional or not. And the old thermostat, which is right here, did not open up uh, in boiling water, so I knew that that was uh, junk and had to be replaced. So, get those hand tight and then tighten with the wrench. Then we'll go ahead and look for the numbers. Six goes to six. Make sure you hear a click. Four in the middle. Put these boots back on correctly. And there you have it. There's your newly installed thermostat on a 2010 Dodge Grand Caravan SXT with 3.8 liter V6. If you like this video, please hit that like button. Drop a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new here. Join our Naughty Pine Life family today. And as always, stay smiling, stay safe, and stay tuned.